Hi everybody. Here's a nice short game from 1907 with Kunitz playing the white pieces and Solomon playing the black pieces. And it's sort of a gambit opening and it's kind of interesting. It starts off with white playing d4, black plays d5, and now white plays the gambit opening by playing the pawn to e4. Black takes the gambit pawn and then white offers him a second pawn, which black takes and now white recaptures with the knight. And now black brings the bishop down to pin the knight. And white goes ahead and develops his queen bishop to e3. And black develops his knight out to c6. And attacking the pawn on d4. And so white just sort of protects the pawn with c3. And now black plays e5, obviously intending to play down and to d4 or e4 and strike at the pinned knight. So white goes ahead and counterattacks by playing his d pawn up and attacking the knight. Black decides to retreat that knight back to e7. And now white plays a double attack move by playing his queen up to a4, giving check, and also simultaneously attacking black's bishop on g4. Now the only way black can meet both threats is obviously to retreat the bishop from g4, to block the check, and now attack the white's queen. So white plays his queen over to e4. Obviously wanting to get his gambit pawn back by taking the pawn on e5. So, black simply plays f6 and defends the pawn. So now, white simply develops his king bishop up to d3, and now black plays knight to g6, which actually turns out to be a major mistake. And if you'd like to pause the video right now and take a look at the position and see if you can see what the mistake is, I'll wait for you. Okay, did you see the mistake? White plays the queen sacrifice, queen takes g6, check. Black then recaptures with the h-pawn, and now white plays bishop takes g6, check, and black now has only one legal move, and that is, of course, king to e7. And now, white swoops in for the kill with bishop to c5, checkmate. A crisscross mate, utilizing both bishops, which is really kind of pretty. I hope you like it, and I'll see you next time.